What's going on my friends and welcome back, I'm Daily Fix and you are watching the Army Ants. Now in between episodes I had a bit of a talk here on uh, on Twitch and I'm, I'm a dumbass, I seriously am a dumbass. We should be processing these guys like crazy, undesirable and yeah, smooth daily voice, jazz daily, hello and welcome, yes, jazz daily. So processing those guys and processing you as well so the template usually runs for the newest species that you'll get so right now these are going to be top pops let's take a look here if we have other things that we should go for yeah that's all fine and dandy let's go into our policies cooperative yeah, eventually I want to go into Expansionist, since the... Oh no, it's actually the Colony Development Speed, the Border Friction, but this one... This one does what? War Exhaust Gain, Naval Capacity, Claiming Influence Cost, we will eventually have to go to Supremist. But we will need to finish the, tra uh, the Tradition Tree, I'm currently... Uh, doing the war doctile policy. Oh, that's what it means. You know, I've never looked into that actually and we'll get some more biological ascension. So with our fleets arriving and a All of them now going in there. So this is going to be our very first complete complete battleship uh, fleet and We should actually just get a mega cannon in there in this design because we're not currently having that this mega cannon. Our uh, yeah. Yeah, we need a mega cannon. Shield damage and hull damage. The mega cannon itself is insane. It is insane. I like it. I like it quite a bit. Uh, well, do we go for medium or large? Yeah, probably large. And we keep the small ones for like smaller ships. Maybe go for Plasma with them. Something like this. So, let's save this. And we can actually save it, which is good. Yes, I like that. Um, we're here. We're just waiting for other fleets to join. Any other ship that we are going to be building will have the Mega Cannon on there. Uh, this Bastion. I need to get some hangers on there as well as the hyper lane. What's the next one? You. They're anchoring. We're not there yet. So let's not be bothered by it right now. We can upgrade for 711. And he's actually currently at a shipyard. Let's upgrade him. Let us upgrade him. And he shortly will be joined by three more battleships. And this one, look at this, 15, 15k. That is just absolutely fantastic. So let's go over here. And we actually completely missed the other fleet. Which is good. It's it's okay. So we'll upgrade you. Are you going to be joining these guys? By the looks of it, you are. Just hopping in there right now, maybe? You know, just, yes, there you go, you did it. Well done. Well done, you ship. So, this battleship. These carriers. Do we need to fix something for the carriers? I don't think so. Oh, there is still that one fleet. So, yeah, we'll uh, have a bit technology of a fight. Conceived. Let's go. New technology is the subs... Uh, subs oh, yes, yes. Advanced combat rolls. No matter what options are there, that's the only one that I want. Oh, not for long, mate. Not for long. We'll take that planet back. So, are we already consuming population and why? Leader experience gain negative a thousand. Negative a thousand. Go away, dude. Negative a thousand. Who are you kidding? Go away. And uh, we'll just get. I don't know. Um, let's take a look first. So, let's see. Food. Yeah, you actually would be quite good as a food guy. As for the other one. Yeah. 
Yeah, let's take you, whatever. It's fine. So that will boost the food as well. Let us make sure we keep selling those foods. Can we buy some more alloys? Yes, we can. And we are now fighting this guy. Let's take a look how this will go. They are right on top of us. Which usually is quite annoying. But we do have those uh, plasma weapons. Oh yeah. Yeah, I can live with this. They had some battleships as well. We lost a few. Best possible outcome. They gave up. They they gave up. <laughs> we admit defeat. We don't think this, uh, but don't think this of anything. Okay, great. Hey, they gave up. Why not? So, you go ahead and upgrade. Let's get our scientist and uh, research this. Research that as well. And let's see, because we now need to move the fleets to another location, the armies. Let's go over there. So this guy is now equivalent and he's having a very, very hard time. And we need his territory. We need his territory. Also, since we're now at peace. <sighs> they must be at peace. Oh, you gotta be kidding me, man. Stop going to war whenever I'm at peace. Negative 103. It's the distance. And apparently, even though they are a hive mind, they're a hive mind. They hate me for being a hive mind. How? How is that possible? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know, man. So we are improving relations. But last month, it did change. Hmm. We could send two. Since he's now at war. He's already friendly. And he doesn't increase. So yeah, we're, we're doing that. We are going to send you. Let's improve relations with you as well. So we would have two envoys there, right? Would that change? Would that double the efforts? Let's wait for the next month. Uh, okay, I don't see any changes actually. Even though we have both of them over there. Okay, so this doesn't do us anything. Fine. Improve relations with those guys. It's fine. Let's go. So the swarm has been strengthened and we're now 23k. Let's do one more upgrade of these three ships. And then we start moving into this direction and we'll immediately declare war. We want to grab as much of this territory as possible. And that is all for future, future ideas. So, agricultural world, what is your problem? We well, knowledge. we could potentially go with more alloys, but for now we'll just um, keep boosting alloy foundations. Or foundries, foundations. That ain't a word, man. That ain't a word. This is the Gaia world. Why didn't I take this? Because it's a holy world. Gaia world, it, that is holy. Okay, that is nice. Also, I want to get rid of the shard and get this relic world. So, we'll use both of these fleets. So, let's keep reinforcing it. He's going to be busy. Which is okay. Can we boost more? Yes. Okay, we've made it at the cap. Finally. And he's now done. 23k. Cool. Let's go ahead over there. And once the other fleet joins, we'll attack the shard. Because he is currently almost there. Technology conceived. Fridge world. Let us keep doing alloys. Impulse Truster, another upgrade. Um, minerals, definitely minerals. Uh, 
and also we should start upgrading our three last stations and once again we are now going to flip you to this place as your home district and same goes for you because the war will be happening right here then we can finally border them and that is what i want how strong are you you're equivalent you're a fanatic purifier as well where are you who are you fighting are you fighting these guys so you have a gateway a resolution has passed so up next now uh, we'll just see that we not they didn't do anything Hmm, you're not doing anything. That's a mistake. Go ahead and... Oh, you're, you're, you're stuck? Okay, so let's get you back. And... Go here. So you can actually help us with... Oh, no, there's something here. Research this project. I can't wait until we actually get the um, the war policy and we can actually start exploding. That's what I've been wanting for such a long as time. So, are you upgrading now? Technology conceived. Technology, war exhaust and claiming cost. Clone armor, leader enhanced selection lineage. Careful, pro uh, careful uh, reproductive planning should be... I'm not sure how this actually works. Could go for naval cap. I would like to get this. So, Wenek, if you're still here, selective lineage policies that affect can change. Oh, that's policies. Okay, let's take it then. And oh, combat rules. Combat rules are going to be so good. And and yes, I will force yeah, another upgrade with that. With new combat rules, will double the power in most of these ships. And you need another upgrade as well. So you're going to be completely filled. You're healed up. You're being upgraded. But we're also building ships here, aren't we? Yes. Okay, for fun of it, let's just make sure we got more alloys. How much do we need? 7k. Prices are extremely high. Technology conceived. And we got mining station outputs plus 10. Destroyer upgrade cost. Let's just go... With auto cannons. Yeah, they're now starting to upgrade nicely. And here we go, the advanced combat rolls. Which is very, very nice. Uh, anomalous ship intelligence. Their own semi-intelligence greatly enhancing reproductive in combat. I think this is well worth it. Take this. It's just a rare tech, not a dangerous tech. Let's go for the upgrades. So, they are a carrier and they now have a 50% increase in range. And they used to have 25. So, they're a lot... They can start firing from a massive, massive range now, which is absolutely great. Like I said, I will force... Can I actually save that already? Yes, they are both safe. You will upgrade over there. And you will do the same thing while we sell these 5,000 and get ourselves to 50 more. So the upgrade actually is happening a lot faster as you can see we were just uh, lacking lacking alloys which is a shame actually how is the species going up to yeah there we go this looks a lot better so once we get this one i'll probably go for evolution mastery so we'll do that right now fleet command limit has increased and we'll go one vision is also nice though. Voidborn will already have habitats. And we are definitely... Right now we're not a habitat species. 
So... Evolution Mastery. Let's take that. And let's take a look at our species. So, modify the template. No. Do we actually have to create one from here? Yes, we have to create one from here. So, you are out. Actually, we didn't care about you at all. We got intelligence. We got uh, monies. We do need to get rid of you now. And let's get... Hmm. Empire Spin, no. No. Leader Lifespan would be nice. Maybe just agricultural jobs. Just so where we got so much resources we can just pump them in. I think that's great. Let's uh, let's get this template out of control. We're going to be setting this template. It's going to be fantastic. So, no more Empire Sprawl from Population, and we'll get a boost in all of the resources as well as in Research. And... Where are your skills in MP? I'm, I'm not, is it positive or negative what you're saying right now? Because I'm, I'm, not, I'm not sure. Let's apply this template, and go for it 54 months, but because I think we... Uh, I'm, I'm doing a, right, a good thing actually. Maybe it's with uh, multiplayers that I'm way too preoccupied with things. Borders closed? I don't care, man. Go away. So, by now, we can actually set the difference in our policies to go to supremacist. So, uh, that's the, so, the diplomatic weight from our fleet power is at 100%. So, currently, the, the diplomatic weight is 5,149. And now we're at 5,312. A claiming cost is now lowered. So, I would assume things would be a lot better. We're upgrading both of our fleets. And... These guys are now starting to look like pushovers. I still want to make a federation with these guys. Come on, just allow me, humor me. Okay, so we got 25k. I think we are going to be attacking the shard. 25k should be enough. I think it's like 15. 15 to 25. Uh, how's our civilian doing? You. Yeah, that's usually not what I want you to do. Nothing. So, we got one already on route. Yes. And you. Let's take a look. Oh, actually, no. We are going to be warring, right? So, we're going to be sending you off into this direction. So, if we get technology that we don't have yet, we can definitely use it to our advantage. So, this is now our battleship fleet. And speaking of fleets, we can increase that. And we can increase that as well. Oh, yeah. This is what's been happening a few times. If we go to this fleet, like, there is these going on. And this only changes if I get out of the game. And make certain that... Um, uh, reload the game, actually, the reload the game. So, what's your problem? You're 35, you need 40, and, yeah, you know, maybe. It's, uh, it's a, it's a deal? I don't know. I don't know if it's a deal. Esteemed hive minds, hi. Um, a decade ago, the army and collective pledged to support the Addison troop, and so you have. The time of your patronage is coming to an end, but we would be remiss not to ask, would you care to renew your subscription? Um, yes, I will renew my subscription. If I am able to get the money. How much do you need? You're, you're, you're way too hungry for this. 
Uh, let's sell a hundred of you. It's a deal. It's a deal, man. We got the auto cannons and ooh, neutron armor. Oh yeah, yeah. Sweet. Let's take it. Sweet. Uh, what's your problem? You. But we can actually build you actually nothing because we don't have anything. A food processing facility on this planet. And we just continue. So, let's get into this position and attack the shard. And we can actually get this relic world. Mm -hmm, a relic world, yay. And we'll make a lot of research out of it. We will definitely um, get it. Definitely. I will even transfer pops to it to actually grow it a lot faster. So, come on. Jump in there. Here we go. 22.4k. Get all of those uh, in there. We're bypassing nothing anymore. Uh, the army itself. Let's see. Oh yeah, the armor is really going down really well. But we still have the auto cannons as well as uh, the giga cannons. They do have giga cannons, right? Oh, look at this. Oh yeah. So, people have started to call it the Circle of Death. And I like it. I like that idea. It's one quarter health and it is going down really, really fast. So, the, ch the shard is almost no more. Speaking of what is almost no more, let's take a look. Clone Vats we have... You know, maybe we should keep this pop around to boost the colony of the Relic World. So, the Shard is taking out... War Declaration... Yeah, I don't care. Don't care about that. And there we go! The demise of the Shard, the Dragon. Of Shard the Dragon. So, we got a Relic, the Rubricator. Let's take a look at that. And immediately get our construction ship. You, what, what, what is you upgrading now? Okay, fine, upgrade that. You. You have nothing to upgrade. You are able to reinforce. Well, before we do that, uh, get rid of those cruisers and increase the amount of battleships. And reinforce. So, construction ship go here and build a starbase. And what we do is... Oh, I'm almost ready to colonize that again, but this is a holy world, so that's not. That would be not good for my health. Let's make sure that we get a colony ship. Yeah, man. We did it. Sweet. I like that. So, go on and heal up. Form a non-aggression pack? Dude, I, I don't care about you. Why would I form a non-aggression pack with you? <laughs> that makes no sense. You're still at war, just beat it. Beat it out of it. You are currently, I think, over here. But I'm not sure about it. Which is fine. So, you're done. 24k. Let's start heading you over here as well. And fleet is at full strength, so that means that we are getting probably around 20 or 30k. And yeah. Cannot reinforce the fleet, huh? Such a shame, such a shame. Anyways, guys, if you're watching this on Twitch, stick around. If you're watching this on YouTube, thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you have enjoyed. I know I have. And uh, leave a like, subscribe, and um, visit me here on Twitch. Yes, link is in the description. See you next time. Have a good one. Bye-bye.